budget. We're worried about what the provincial budget's going to do, or the federal budget. What are you afraid of? It's their money. Let's see what they're going to deliver to us. Or as the rumors going around, they might pull the funding. That's what we have to find out. That's why I moved the motion to go until April 4th yesterday. No, you didn't. They, you cannot go ahead. People hate the St. Clair. They hate these streetcars. cars. You can call them what you want. People want subways, folks. Subways, subways. They don't want these damn street cars walking up our city. That's what they don't want. Uh, Folks, you, 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 you get on and ask, okay, well, St. Clair's, St. Clair's not an LRT. Show me an LRT in Toronto. We don't have one. It is St. Clair. This is going to be St. Clair Part 2. Went from $40 billion to $100 billion. This is going to be a boondoggle of billions of dollars to make the e-house scandal look minuscule. <laughs> it is going to be outrageous. Mark my words, there's not one, not one project that we have done in transit that has come under budget. Not one. This is going to be the same thing. Let's find out where the provincial and federal government stand. Support Councillor Thompson. Support the people of this city that want subways, folks. Subways they want. Thank you. Please, if I can ask the audience, please no applause. Councillor Perks. Well, there you have it, Speaker. There you have it. Our job as Toronto City Council is to bring this city together to make the improvements necessary to make it a better place to live. That's what is before us today with Councillor DeBearmaker's motion. That's what the expert panel has put in front of us. Let's invest in making transit great right across the city. That's the plan we have in front of us. But instead of that, instead of that, Councillor Thompson suggests we defer it again. And why? so we can have additional months of mindless campaign rhetoric designed to split Toronto apart, designed to create envy, designed to make false borders, false divisions, and make sure that nothing gets built so that everybody in the city is angry at everybody else. That's exactly what Councillor Thompson's motion and the speech we just heard is about. It's about tearing Toronto's consensus down. It's about telling some Torontonians you can have something and telling other Torontonians you have nothing. I reject the politics of division. I reject the politics that tries to set one Torontonian against another. I reject the proposal that we continue to have uh, a lack of decision making, a lack of clarity, a lack of consensus, a lack of vision. Putting forward a deferral now and trying to make Torontonians despise each other is the worst politics of division. It is a way of destroying the hope in this city. I reject it and I hope all of you do as well. Please, no applause.